Hello friends, in this session we will be taking a look at the themes which are available in the recent versions of IBM BPM, how to customize them globally and specifically for colors, size of the input text boxes, etc. So as you must be aware, there are two themes available within uh, IBM BPM environment. One is in the BPM UI toolkit, which is a Spark UI theme. And another one is in the system toolkit itself, which is the BPM theme. So you can make copies of these themes and customize them to be specific to your application. Let's take a look at a user interface with the default BPM theme. So this is the default BPM theme and all the labels are on top by default unless you configure them to be on the left. And all the input boxes are pretty big and we have we do not have rounded corners but we have square corners for all the themes. And the color scheme is uh, as you can see uh, blue, light blue, light green, light pink etc for all the so let's take a look now at a customized theme and the differences there. So what we have done is in terms of themes, we have taken uh, theme colors. We have taken the colors from Bootstrap and we have customized them into a copy of the BPM theme. So specifically the areas which we have changed is this base color, uh, this one, this one, and this one so what is happening is it has the less um, the BPM themes are based on less files and less files are leaner style sheets sometimes stylized as less and they support variables functions etc inside it and using those functions the theme uh, creates a set of four or five colors based on a base color for example this is the base color and this is the lighter version, slightly darker and more darker version of it. So you only need to change the base color, which is a hash value and the other colors change automatically. Then the next area is basically the radius. Radius uh, base value is here, radius large and radius small values are there. If you increase these values, then all your input boxes will be rounded and your buttons will be rounded on the corners. Also, you can take a look at the source file for the less and you can specify your own custom CSS uh, code here, which will get applied to the entire application to all the user interfaces across the entire application if you have selected the theme. And to select a custom theme for a process app, you go to process app settings you can select one of the themes. So we have a custom theme available, which we have selected. Now let's take a look at the user interface, how it appears different from our base theme after the customizations. As you can see, the labels due to a global custom CSS tag have been placed on the left. So you don't need to individually go to each label and move them to the left. You can apply a style sheet globally and the color scheme is different here so let's compare it with our previous base theme and you can see the differences so as you can see the input box corners are rounded here the labels are on the left the color scheme has changed so this is just a starting example you can get more refined and detailed about the theme and change uh, a lot of aspects about the theme. S since uh, in the design, uh, they, we have fonts, forms, buttons, checkboxes, sections, tables, tabs, all these can be customized. But this is just a basic idea of how to get started about customizing a theme in IBM BPM or BAW. Thank you.